Hello everyone, welcome to another day in the life video, this time from Montserrat. If you're new to the channel, we're Arnold and Edwina, and we're taking a year off work to rest and travel in 2022. On our first day in Montserrat, we woke up at a little past 8 to sub-zero temperature. We had toast and eggs for breakfast and bundled up to face the cold. This is the apartment we're staying in, the Abad Marset apartment. I'll include a quick apartment tour here so you can see what it's like. It has a simple decor, basic facilities, central heating, relatively Spartan for some of you perhaps, but hey, we're in the monastery in the middle of a mountain. So this is spacious and comfortable for us. We could hear the church bells from here, but they're not too loud to disturb us. So they're a nice addition. To the atmosphere. In the morning, Montserrat is very quiet as most visitors come here on day trips and start arriving at 10 to 11 a.m. Good morning everyone, we're up today in Montserrat and we're going down to Monistro to do some shopping and have a sightseeing around town. So the last time we were here we took the cable car but this time around because we're staying here for a few nights we actually have unlimited rights on the Premolera train you see behind me. Um, come with us and we'll show you the view. The Kremalera or Rec Railway connects the town of Monistrol and the Montserrat Monastery. So this is early morning and we are the only two persons in the whole train. The line is five kilometers long. The journey takes about 15 minutes and it's very scenic. We went down at Monistrol Villa, and look at the view from here. We enjoyed a morning stroll through the town's small winding roads. Also very quiet in the morning, it felt like we were the only two people up and about. Thankfully, the local supermarket and greengrocer were open, so we got what we needed.
with more beautiful views on our way up. And here we are coming out of the tunnel of the apostles and entering the station. monastery level down to Santa Copa or the Holy Grotto where the image of the uh, Black Madonna, Virgin Mary, was founded. Yeah, it's about 2.7 kilometers uh, round way. So uh, it will take around an hour and a half or two hours depending on our pace. Let's see how we go. Let's go. Let's go. takes us through artworks depicting the mysteries of the rosary, starting with the joyful mysteries, then the sorrowful mysteries, and ending with the glorious mysteries. These were built by various artists between 1896 and 1916. The hike's been okay so far, but we've been going downhill. So the yes. challenge would be coming back yeah, to the monastery level. In some part of the trek, there are also sleets, so we have to be very careful. Sleets of ice. Yes. Yes. So it's very slippery. But also, I think it's doable. It's not that far. Yeah, it's a fun hike. <laughs>
It's an important place of pilgrimage as the image of the Virgin Mary was believed to have been sighted inside this cave back in 1239. This chapel was built at the end of the 17th century on the site. Here, we could find the reproduction of the holy image. The original image is now inside the Montserrat Basilica. marking and according to Edwina this actually signify that you are on the right track so if you are on the yes. right track there are two lines parallel to each other one white and the other is red, red. so you can see yeah. this one this seems to be the old one and somebody just paint over it but since yeah we are on the right track yep as opposed to a cross like one white, one red, red forming across. We kept seeing this little bird throughout our hike. Is it the same one following us? disappointed that we didn't bring a snack with us. we see the marking that is less navigational and more on the vandalism side of things. <laughs> uh, kids, don't do this. wash two plates when you can wash one. We finished it off and had some mandarins for dessert. As we relaxed, 
we played Genshin Impact together, a game we both enjoy these days. And that's another day well spent, all. Good night, thank you for watching, and have a good rest yourself.